We must understand yesterday. We must confront yesterday. And I'm going to talk about something in a minute about how we maintain our understanding of yesterday. But we can't live there. We can't continue to live in slavery. This is 1999. We are looking at another millennium. We have the responsibility to take control of our communities and our lives. Take our lives back. Take our love back. We didn't let them down because something was wrong with us. We let them down because we were rendered powerlessness. The victimizer is white men, Caucasians, Europeans. They are the ones who did that. Black women, you are not responsible for your rape, but you were raped. You were raped, and you still have mixed feelings about it. You've got to come to grips with that. You can't blame me for the hurt that you experience. You've got to understand that your hurt and my hurt came from the same source. You've got to forgive you. You've got to forgive me. I've got to forgive you because you were not responsible for losing your life to the same person who took my life. But I can't continue to walk around uh, uh, masquerading myself as being the stud of the planet Earth, feeling that my manhood is in my penis. The feeling that my ability to be a sperm donor is my only claim to fame. Sisters, you can't go around using yourself as a breeder, believing your seductive capabilities is the greatest power you've got. You've got to understand to let that go and then begin to build on the real you that's an African woman, that's an African man. Okay, letting go. Last piece of this, emotional. This is the emotional part. So I hope you're getting uncomfortable. I hope you're getting kind of antsy. I hope you're sweating a little bit. I hope you got some tears. I hope your heart is beating. I hope you say, I wish Akbar would shut up. I don't want to hear no more of this. Because if you're feeling that, then the emotion is what I'm trying to get you to understand. We must understand that the other part of the emotion <clears throat> is that we have to kill the oppressor. We must kill the oppressor. Now, mighty warriors who are ready to go out and get somebody, I'm talking about the one in here. I'm talking about the one, because where we stand now, if you had a bomb that could blow up every Caucasian on the planet, it would do you no good. You would be just as oppressed tomorrow morning if every Caucasian here left. You've got to kill him here.